The question is whether FeI3, iron 3 iodide, is acetic, basic, or neutral when it's dissolved in water. And to figure that out, we need to know the neutralization reaction that produced the FeI3. So we have the base, iron 3 hydroxide. It's a base, it's an OH, a hydroxide binded to a metal. That's our base. And hydroiodic acid, this H in front, tells us it's probably an acid. So we have this acid and the base. They neutralize each other, and we get this iron 3 iodide plus water. So now we know the neutralization reactions. We need the strength of each of these substances here. Iron 3 hydroxide, if we look at this table here, we don't see for the bases, we don't see iron 3 hydroxide. So this is going to be a weak base. It's not on our strong base list. We call it a weak base. HI, right here, hydroiodic acid, that's a strong acid. So I'm just going to write SA up here. So we have the strength of the acid in the base. Now we can figure out the pH of the FeI3 dissolved in water. Weak base and strong acid. Here's a weak base, strong acid. The pH will be less than 7. So this is going to be acetic. So in answer to our question, when FeI3 is dissolved in water, the solution that results is going to be acetic. The pH, that's going to be less than 7. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.